Hey guys, it's me, Brendan, and I'm back for another video. Spirit Halloween, or I don't know if it was them, but official images of the themes have been leaked. So, the first one I would really like to check out with you guys, it looks super sick, and let's just dive right in. So, spoilers ahead for Spirit Halloween 2022, if you don't want any spoilers, then why are you watching this? <laughs> Anyways, people who do want to come here for the spoilers and are really seeking out the leaks. Yeah, and here we go. Spirit Halloween, it says, it says in the top middle of the screen, Spirit Dr. J. Reaper Monster Laboratory, which will be the theme for this year. Um, on the right side of the screen, we can see Lord Raven here. He's another one of the new animatronics that got leaked beforehand. Uh, he is around $280, I think. And behind the sign, you can see that uh, Jack the Reaper is just there, popping out of a hole in the wall. And pipes seem to be holding up the sign. Uh, here's another one of the big props on the left side of the screen. Which is actually way taller, or probably about a foot taller than Lord Raven. Um, his name is Possessed Pumpkin, although we don't have any, like, animation info on him. Like, we don't know what he does, nor do we know what Lord Raven does. But I would assume that they both turn side to side, uh, considering, I mean, that's just how they look. And the posing and the position of Possessed Pumpkin has a striking similarity to that of Crouchy. Uh, so I'm thinking that he might have the same type of animation style as Crouchy. Um, so let's move on to the next photo. Alright guys, so here's the other image of the theme. Uh, there seems to be actually no really new animatronics in this image. It's mainly empty, uh, I believe that this photo may have been taken while they were still setting up, you know? Um, but there's Grimm on the left side of the screen. You can see he's just there, standing there. And in the middle, I can see on the floor what seems to be kind of a trap door, I guess? Or, I suppose. And I have seen that some of the new animatronics will require, like, an electric box with a lever that you have to pull down to activate them. It seems pretty cool. But this image doesn't really have much more to say. I mean, it's a cool lab theme. Kind of medieval-styled. At first, I thought, hey, that looks like either the clock tower or like a medieval castle, and to be honest, it does kind of look more like a castle, but I do like the theme idea that they're going with with the medieval type lab. So let's hop on to the next photo. Alright guys, so here's the next photo. It is really blurry, but right there near the middle of the screen you can see a sign I can't read what it says, but I think near the top of the sign it says Spirit Testing Lab, and then something above that and underneath it. Um, but we can see on top of the theme we got some, like, some cool, like, bug zapper type lights, and we got some blue lights near the bottom. We can see Mr. Dark there, uh, on the left side of the screen, or no, on the right side of the screen next to the middle. Um, then... We can see a gravestone right next to Mr. Dark, and we see a we see two girls in a blue and pink dress. Um, the girl in the blue dress is actually going to be Reagan from The Exorcist, who projects. I think she turns her head all the way around, and projects an image of the demon from the movie on the wall. Um, the girl in the pink dress is called Betty Sharp. And earlier on in the year, we had the Halfway to Halloween teaser, which had a hidden prop audio in it, which is speculated to be Betty Sharp's audio. Um, over there, the big guy uh, on the left side of the screen 
that is going to be a new type of clown that Spirit has never really done yet. A radioactive clown who is Nozzles the Clown. He has a little radioactive symbol on his shirt, and I'm just so excited to see him. He is $350. Gosh, he is expensive. And uh, down there next to the gravestone, we have, I think it might be the shortest animatronic for this year, uh, Lil Skelly Bones, who's coming back, although he seems to not have his swing set. Seems that he has learned how to use his legs. <laughs> yeah. So let's head on to the next image. Alright guys, so here's the next image. There are no animatronics set up for this. Although I think this might be the back of that one theme that had like Mr. Dark and everybody. Um, I think this might be the back of that theme. Uh, there are two windows in the center which I believe are going to be screens, like it was last year with the factory floor theme. Uh, we have some boarded up windows to the side, and I really like the kind of, like, stone rocks texture. Uh, as I said before, it really does look more like a castle than anything, but I'll let you guys decide on what you think it looks like. Um, this image doesn't really have a lot to say about it. I mean, it's just, I think, the back of a theme. But I'm really excited for Spirit Halloween 2022. I'm sure that the sneak peeks are going to be rolling in soon. And I'm excited to finally get the store locator up. And just finally be able to go to a spirit store. And I know you guys are too out there in the Haunter community. So I hope you have a good day and I'll see you next time.